Tonight I'm going to show you three ways to remove a stripped Allen head bolt. A good way, a better way, and the best way. So if you're new here and you want to learn little tips like tool reviews, projects, and more, consider subscribing below because I'm going to continue to do this weekly. So let's get over here and I'm going to show you what we got. All right, what we have here is an M6 stripped Allen hex head, socket head, whatever you want to call it, bolt. And as you can see, I've intentionally stripped it. Four millimeter is the size that fits it. The first trick here does not work every time. It's going to depend on where the bolt is placed. It's going to depend on if you can get to it. The style of socket head like this would be a lot easier to get it with this trick. But if you have a pair of vice grips or the or these cobra pliers, that's these right here are going to be your best bet to remove them. And they're not very expensive at all. And let me show you. All you have to do is get a hold of it, grip, and turn. As I said, this won't always work. This is just some one thing you can try to start off with. I like these Cobra pliers because of how thin the head is and because of the grip. Once these things latch on, they won't let go. Now you could use a pair of vice grips here, but as I said, this is my preferred way and it will remove it if you can get a hold of it. So what if you can't get a hold of it? Let's go to number two. Now if you've tried to get a hold of the bolt and you can't get a hold of it, you could try this way next. Take your ball peen hammer, place it over the rounded hole, and hit down with a sledgehammer. That may flare it in enough to allow the Allen socket to catch a hold. If it doesn't, you could try to find a bigger size, whether it be a metric, then you want to look for a standard in a bigger size, or if it's a standard, you want to look for a metric in a bigger size. In this case, it's a 3 16 and you could take and place it over this hole and with a brass hammer hit down and knock and bang the socket in. That may give you enough to be able to remove this. Now if that way doesn't work, this is the best way. This is a stripped Allen removal set. This set here is a Mac tool set that will cost around $150 or so, but there are cheaper options and I will link one down below. If you ever run across any strip Allen heads, you definitely need to have a set of these. So we know it's a four millimeter. If you don't know the size, you obviously will just pick until you find a size that works. And as you can see, these have teeth that will grip the rounded edges, similar to a bolt extractor. You push it down in and it'll grip. And remove the stripped Allen head. If you found this video helpful, consider subscribing to my channel. I'll be posting tips and tricks like this weekly to try to help people in a stuck situation like this. So thanks for watching. Take it easy.